Okay. Wait. Whoa. Have you been going this whole time? Nope. Nope. Don't want that. But yeah, that should be good. Okay. Hey, everyone. How you doing? Uh, today is going to be a commission of uh, Tanya with a, well, let's just say it. She's fat. She's got like a blown up figure by, I don't know, the commissioner said, kind of like a, a ray gun from off screen. Kind of like that opening uh, of Earthworm Jim. And I was like, okay, I don't, I don't usually do this. I'm not, I don't usually do these commissions, but I'm not foreign to them. And I was like, yeah, sure. Because I needed the moolah, but there was nothing abhorrent about it. They let me, uh, I ran by one of my, um, I ran the art style that I wanted to emulate for it. Um, what's the guy's name, though? And they were down. They were down to clown. What was it? Hey, Alter. What was her name? Okay. The, a, that's a W instead of a Y? It's not Tanya, it's Tan... Tan... Waya? Okay. Okay. Cool. Changing it right now. Anyway, how y'all doing? I'm just here. I'm streaming inside instead of my office. Just because it's hot. Actually, no, that's a lie. I've actually got quite a comfortable setup out outside now it's just that uh i gotta set up like a, a fan and i gotta drag the my secondary computer out there to start streaming both stream and record what i'm doing here right now it's just like ah, nah. i am going to try and put up some blankets on the door and see if that They've got those. They've got like kits where you you can buy a a, a, a dampener. And they're like eighty bucks. And then I remember a video that I saved from a long time ago. Let's see who did it. Was it D Baker? I think it was D Baker who was showing people how to make their own uh, DUI low maintenance cheap. Home Depot inspired or Lowe's if you were so inclined um, recording booths and it was like literally just made up of uh, PVC tubing and moving blankets and you build yourself a little cage and that's how you you start your recordings uh, which is cool because I used to do the same thing like we used to have little uh, camping kits that worked on the exact same principle where you'd have to uh, you'd have these long pipes or like yeah they were basically pipes they were a lot thinner like threaded pipes you would almost say and then you'd slip them through this fabric and then you'd you'd have to connect with either a straight piece or a, or a curved piece and that's how you'd set up your tent so I was like oh yeah cool I'm down to clown But I am just sitting here inside my office with a lapel mic close to me as I try to draw. No, I don't want to restart. I uh, won't be able to tune in Friday because I'll be driving to the beach. Okay, Friday. Um, are you good tonight? Uh, if you're good tonight, then I can actually... Hey, Michael. If you're good tonight, then I can switch uh, Guardians of the Galaxy to tonight. Or I can even do it in the mid middle of the day sometime. I mean, I can mess with... Uh, mess with uh, Melanie's schedule. And have her stream then.
No internet security. You do not need to restart for an update. No working late. Okay, well, we'll figure it out. So any, oh, I was going to say, who's the inspiration? Because, like, again, this is not my, this is not the body type that I would normally draw. So I was like, okay. Um, and then I went through. And I am a fan of certain artists who who do this stuff because their art drawing their artwork is just so good. Um and my mind immediately went to the guy who does uh, um um Step Monster. That one webcomic that, that hasn't been updated in forever. Um but anyway, uh Monster Grotto, I think is what they call themselves on Tumblr. Anyway, I was just like, okay, I'll I'll do this commission uh, if I can kind of do it in this this art style. And they were like, yeah, that that works out fine. What's up, Johnny? What's up? Yeah, as in the Crash character. How do you pronounce it? Is it Tanya or Tanjuana? So I heard that they're remaking, uh, I heard they're remaking uh, Snake Eater, which I saw one, uh, I saw a clip, or not a clip, but a thumbnail on YouTube, and it looks like his forehead was generated by AI. I just, I just don't know what to say. It looks like the bandana is like, Skin tight, like you would expect from like a superhero costume. Which, um, of course, is a, kind of a big deal since, you know, uh, Metal Gear Solid is a huge thing for Konami, who really doesn't make games anymore. Um, and, of course, I think Kojima, there's bad blood between them. And, uh, oh, did you look up Step Monster? Yeah, they do that, and they, he's also got, like, other side characters. It's, like, very, you know, they're very all bottom-heavy. He has a type. As does our commissioner. Which I'm down, I'm down to clown. By the way, how is my voice? Is it a little too low? Is it a little too... I'm trying to... Again, I was saying, I've got... I was looking at those kits where you can soundproof your your walls and they've got them but and then um let's see where was i at the d oh yeah d baker he was telling you how to make a, a recording booth out of moving blankets and uh pvc tubing very nice of him to do so a little crackly okay that's fine uh, the Foam Sisters. No, not really. Wait, do you mean like the original Metal Gear as in like the, the NES game or like the, the, the first one? Uh, 
I'm just Do, do, do. The, oh, okay, I see. The one on the MSX2? Oh, really? Was that on that... You're talking about the one on tape, right? The one they kind of paid tribute to uh, with... Um, with Not Snake uh, putting the tape in the uh, tape player. At the end of uh, number five, which I have, I picked up for like ten bucks. Maybe I should actually try that. Try to play that sometime. That would seem like fun. That would be my first Metal Gear I've ever played since I think. Oh Lord. I think I played two. Again, I didn't have PlayStation growing up. And you know what? I would hear all these amazing things. Like, they would, uh, like, the big people would, like, not people, but, like, class student, uh, classmates would be like, oh man, it's like, uh, you're playing Nintendo? It's like, you should play, like, Metal Gear Solid. It's, like, the most realistic, like, uh, you know, uh, it, it's just life changing. You'll never look at video games the same way again. And you, you get, I, I've gotten into uh, I've gotten into the lore through various channels, and I'm like, this is a cartoon. This is just this is as as believable as uh, you know a, a plumber going into a, a different dimension. Um. I get that. I was just like, you know, uh, you get like, can I put this? I'm trying, my mind is, is running around different things. I may have a little touch of the sun. Um, is the mic really that bad? It was working okay before. It sounds okay over my speakers. Hold on. Let me see if there's uh, some crackle that the headphones can pick up. Mm, do, do, do. Yeah, there's some crackle. Okay, hold on. Hold on to your butts. How's this? Is this a little better? Oh, why is it all the way down here? There. There, how's that? Is that a little better? Or is it still poppy? Testing, one, two, three. Jeez.
Okay, screw it. I just got my really good H1 mic microphone. And it's got a really short cord. I thought the lapel mic would be nice. But, um, I can tell my audio levels are higher. So it's, it's picking up whatever I'm doing. <sighs> it might be worse. I don't know why that lapel mic gives me so much trouble when I try to connect it to this computer. Um, it doesn't do that when I connect it to this computer or the computer outside. Which makes me think that there's something to do with the USB connections on this one. Um, especially it doesn't do it when I, I connect it to my phone with an adapter and then use the phone as a Bluetooth microphone. Weird. I'll just have to remember that. Okay, much better. Oh, well, anyway, you taken off? Okay, see you, Alter. Let me know if we, uh, we can do something for... How about Saturday? Is Saturday good for, for uh, Guardians of the Galaxy? Anyway, what was I saying? Something cartoons, something, something. Let's see. Oh yeah, just how, like, I don't know, if it's live action or on a certain channel, people will treat it like it's way more... Like, it's not as cringe as just some of the other stuff. Even more cringe than... I was like, they, they started shoving on clips of House on TV, and it's like, this patient thinks he's uh, he's in a video game. And I was like, ugh. That's just obnoxious. Anyway, do, can I... Can I do this inside the folder? Yeah, I think I can. I need to shrink... I need to shrink a figure, but I also need to keep the... the, uh... not stencils, what do you call them? Um... Perspective rulers in place. Huh. Oh, so Foam Sisters... <laughs> oh, pardon me. Foam Sisters is like a new uh, FPS, but it's like their answer to Splatoon. Here, let me look this up. Boom. Sisters. Nope, just foam. Nope, just different types of packing foams. And then floral foam. Uh, any tips on drawing large characters like this? Weight gain on stuff? I don't know. I just draw them bigger, if that makes any sense. Start. You don't need to worry about hips or pelvises. Just draw a big old circle. Hey, Lucas. It's not realistic in any sort of uh, feasible way. I know that there's artists who who can do all the, you know, the the, the fat folds and the, 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 the way the sort of uh, the folds in the skin and the way the, the, the mass sort of bunches up. This is just cartoony.
very much like uh, Monster Grotto, who his character he's he's also got like great line weight. Um, his drawings they've got like I don't know what he does, but they've all uh, his line work is just really cool. It like gets thicker and thinner at certain points. Do, 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 do. Euro artists got that fold anatomy down. Who? Euro? It's foam. Oh, foam stars. Okay, that's my bad. Thanks, it's your Lloyd. Um. Do, 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 do. Some folks in, are said slime girls are best places to start. Huh. Okay. I don't know about that. Wasn't there an episode where of Aladdin where Jasmine turned into like slime? Uh any waking artist that you admire? Um, like I said, I think Monst Monster Grotto was one. Is a good one. Um who else? Oh, 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 uh, uh, Spo. Here, let's see. Super Spo. S-P-O-A? I think that's what they do. They do good work. They've, uh, got, they're sort of, they've got that dual thing, oh, pardon me, dual things going on, where, um, they've got a, a main channel and a side, uh, not channel, account. A main, a main account and then a side account. Yeah, yeah, he was, he was in, um, he's been in the chat for a while. Foam stars. Okay, let's look at foam stars. Nope, I'm just getting foam stars. As in foam, foam stars from like Michaels and Hobby Lobby. Foam Stars of Video Game. Oh, it's one word. Splatoon like from Square Enix. Oh boy. Oh jeez, that's just a straight up girl. I mean, I was expecting the anatomy of the characters to be like a little bit more cartoony. It's just a VTuber. It's a girl, video game girl, bathwater, the video game. Uh, the who? The manga nurse? Your Moto's Monster Infirmary. Oh! Okay, that sounds cool. Now, you see, I like big characters. Like, whoever made, um... Oh, look at that. I think I've seen this artwork before. Yeah. Okay, is there also something about an elf? An elf that eats too much french fries or something? 
Um, and she's just kind of like thick. Yeah, look at this. This isn't even like, uh, what was that other one Nintendo tried to make? The ninja one. Party shooter. Okay, so you have to be a... Oh, wait, do they mean party shooter? Do they mean, like, they have individual... powers? Okay, let me see the full... The roster. It looks like there's some sort. Yeah, they've all. Looks like they've all got different powers. One's got a robot. One's got a fish. One's a little clown ice cream girl. One's just a straight up pimp. And one's got puffy sleeves. Cool. Ninja gum. Okay. Hey, May. Yeah, they even call it Bath Vegas. So again, my joke my joke was a little closer to home than I thought. Uh, let me look at the trailer while we're doing this. So when they say party shooter, they really mean like each one has different powers or it's all the same powers and it's a grab... Uh... Oh, no, 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 turn it down. This looks like one of the games that will be free on the Epic Store. Yeah, that's what the first comment says. Okay. Okay. One's got a tank, a la May. Ooh, one's got a, a plague mask. Yeah, this is VTuber Brawl. Oh, she's got to take the green stuff on her. Okay, they're shooting foam bullets. They're bouncing off of... Uh, of... They're bouncing off of bubbles. That guy just shot a whole bunch of... Uh, campaign, I assume. They're, they're sliding across the bubble fields. This looks like just a bubble party. Okay, so this is basically uh, Fortnite, Overwatch, maybe Apex would be a more, because it's not a first person, it's a third person over the shoulder. Um, and uh, more whimsical. Who's the sniper character? I bet it's the girl with the plague mask. If that's the case, then yeah. That's a lot, though. That's a lot of weird foam. Oh, okay, and and because it's it's of course it's a mix of Splatoon, so you try to cover the most of the field. She's just a VTuber. She's in all black, and then pops the bubble. Okay, okay. I, Square Enix is going to cancel this after a year. Hey, gent. No, I was just, uh, I was just watching that one trailer. I like shooters. And we were talking about, uh, what were we talking? Oh yeah, uh, Metal Gear Solid. For just a little bit. Um. I have Metal Gear Five, but that would be my first Metal Gear that I would ever play in earnest, which is fine. Mm. Do, 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 do. 
Dragon's Dogma 2? You know what? I've actually I've never seen Dragon Dogma 2. Hey, Omelina. How you doing? Uh, I'm drawing a uh, Big Tanya. Rising. Oh yeah, I've got Rising too. All my exposure to Metal Gear Solid is uh, second-hand through the YouTubers. Uh, mainly, um, mainly the two best friends, or and then the super friends, and then to a lesser extent, Castle Super Beast and uh, Matt McMuscles. Not a lesser extent. I still watch and enjoy both of them, but you know. It's not together anymore. No, I don't need that. Need I want? Uh, just wait. It's a brush, a special brush that I've got. That's fine. Perfect. Damn it, I did it again. On the wrong layer. Um... Let's see, what are we saying? Inspiration? Not a fan of the big women's stuff, but anyway. I watched that. I watch that goes a lot. Hmm. Except Lee, I'm not sure what happened to him. I don't know. I think he just, they said he just had trouble with his, um, I don't know. He just fell out of streaming. Oh yeah, there's a platform live stream. Yeah, yeah, PlayStation. I don't know. Is it over now? By now, it's got to be over. Oh yeah, God Hand. Who? What did they go on to do? I forget. They did a bunch of weird stuff, and then they finally made it one time with something. I forget.
Was it Grasshopper? Did they go on to make, like, made Bayonetta and all that weird crap? Oh, okay, so they did go to make... Okay, so they did do all that stuff. Cool. They're, like, really good at obtuse games. I enjoyed Wonderful 101. Because that's, like, their one game of theirs that I, like, was, like, really, really, really wanted to play. Um, although I will say, yeah, some of the controls are a little obtuse. And I kept getting caught on, uh, what was it? Just different parts of the actual stage. You couldn't, like, draw around. Well, the whole game was... I played it on PlayStation, and the whole game was made for the little pad. So you could, you know, do weird stuff. And look at the pad when you go into buildings. They had a screen on top of the screen for the PlayStation, and just didn't work. Although they do have, uh, they I didn't know this, they have a DLC. And uh, I was just, like, I saw on, I follow an account called um, Cheapskate Gamings. That's where I know when they have uh, a bunch of sales and stuff. And I, one day they said, uh, the, the, the DLC is available on the PSN network. And I was like, that game has DLC? And then a bunch of comics comments underneath it were like, I didn't know this game had DLC. What the hell? What the hell? You know? And uh, then all of a sudden I turn on my PlayStation 4 to do something and Wonderful 101 just starts to update for some reason. I was like, oh, okay, it's that DLC. Cool. Maybe we'll uh, play it sometime. Oh, is that Black Cat actually going to be in Spider-Man 2 across the, the multiverse or whatever? Oh god, speaking of Foam Sisters or Stars or whatever they're called. Um, yeah. Not, not... You don't have a lot of confidence in a company that that uh, closes all their online stuff after like a year. They were the first ones who started to like back out of the uh, the multiplayer, you know, the Fortnites and all that stuff. Well, they were awesome once in the day. I think they've uh, cashed out all their, their goodwill on, you know, being Final Fantasy and everything. Which, by the way, I still have Final Fantasy IX on the PC. I need to go through and play that, because that's my favorite Final Fantasy. 
I'm not a huge Final Fantasy mark, but I played enough of it. And Final Fantasy IX was the one that got me into it all. Hey, Arcade, how's it going? Um, oh, yeah, NFTs and, and the AI art, yeah, that's all garbage. Speaking of which, support your local SAG people who are on strike. I saw a clip today of uh, Daffy Duck, or, uh, you know, the voice actor who does Daffy Duck, Ben something. Um, or is it Ben? Or is it his last name Buez or something? Oh, well. Anyway. And he was uh, using the Daffy Duck voice to protest. It's hilarious. They used to do that, like back when Disney had his their first strike. They, uh... Because they were all the artists, and they were all the voice actors. They can... They can draw all that stuff. So you had Donald Duck. Uh... You know, fighting against, uh... The man. Ducks don't give a fuck. Dex will just throw down with anybody. Like mice and rabbits, they'll try to be diplomatic, but... Eric, where did I get... Okay, I put B in front of Eric, and I just, like... I, Eric's a short name. I saw the B, and then I put... Yeah. There we go. Oh, my my thing's been way behind my preview. Where are we at? Oh, okay, we're doing good. Yeah, she's starting to look like Tanya.
Oh yeah, well, uh, you... apparently, um, SAG is like really, really monitors, like scabs. Mm. Yeah, there's there's no guff about that. They don't like them. Let's see. I need help. Stand. Like Ton, like Dawn. Ton. Ton, yeah. Ton, yeah. Blend the two together. Do, 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 do. What's the song? I don't even know. Let's see. I don't have. Uh, oh, wait. Let me see. The title is Love Struck by Ease Jammy Jams. This is all stuff from the YouTube library. So, um, you probably heard it a million times in like commercials and, and other YouTube channels and stuff like that. <laughs> I was, uh, I don't know why, but I've gotten on a kick. YouTube keeps, uh, recommending me all this, like, old stuff. Like, I got... What was I watching the other day? The, um... The, I, I saw the 1985... Winner for Best Animated Short. YouTube all of a sudden just sent that out to me. Uh, let's see, where is it? Where is it? It is called... Bella and... Something or other. Just wait. No? Okay, you can't search your own history. It... Sends you right back to YouTube. Any fans of Stu... No, never heard of it. And hey, Zach, how's it going? Let's see, where is it? Where are you? 
Oh yeah, the um the original presentation for the 1988 uh, Little Mermaid early presentation reel, which is like full of all the original sketches and everything like that. Where is it? I know I saw it. Watched it earlier. Okay, here we go. Oscar nomin Oscar winner, Anna and Bella. All right. Ah, cool. Okay, so it's a musician then. I need another reference. Hold on. I've always been curious to ask, why is your YouTuber see-through? I don't know, I just made it that way. I just, um... Uh, at the time, this is more like a ping tube. Um, I was just figuring out how to... Like, what all the ins and outs were, like, for setting this up in OBS. This is strictly OBS. There's no other program involved with it. Uh, Melanie was also when she, when I originally made her, she was also uh, just strictly within OBS. There were no outside programs, unlike now. She's still a hybrid because her, her mouth... OBS picks up sound really well and the program that I'm using to animate her, live... live or purr or something um, doesn't have any function like that so I have to and I have to keep her her lips and her mouth on a separate on a separate layer away from her main body and then I I combine them all within OBS so that OBS moves the the top part of her mouth and the lower part of her mouth and then her whole body in three separate layers and then combines them this, uh, this is just like, let's see, what, how many JPEGs are we dealing with here? This is just the bottom of my, the jacket. The jacket is a separate layer. The, and the glasses and the hair are just the top layer. And they move at different rates. The, the, the hair and the glasses pop up faster and higher than the jacket does so it makes it look like there's kind of a weird perspective going on and also um i've got a mask on the the sound bars the the visualizer so that it just plays through the glasses i don't know i just thought it was a neat visual there's no other reason um and uh, it's simple it's it's kind of it's striking enough and i am trying to figure out how to draw her cheek over and over again um yeah so that's why it's very simple i just i can just pop it in and pop it up and just use it
And what we just uh, Oh shit! Thank you, uh, thank you, gent. Aw, oh, thanks. You're always uh, dipping me more money. Um, do do do. Good. This is a YouTube musician who does video game. Oh, okay. The fine print about the outer world. Okay, cool. I'm gonna check that out. Thank you so much, gent. I'm thinking of, I, mean, I gotta sit down and actually plan it out, but I'm trying to figure out how to give Melanie more uh, expressions. So that, you know, like a losing expression, an excited expression, an angry expression, and then little sub-animations that I can get to work. Yeah, I think this one turned out well, especially like the art of the line art that I did on it.
<laughs> Good one, Jen. Uh, let's see. What else is going on? I don't know. I'm a little tired um, since I, I did all that plumbing yesterday and then I did got up and did the, the backyard today. Got all the little, we got a little Las Aloma tree. And they've got like teeny tiny tiny leaves. And it's like, would you rather like, would you rather like blow up a hundred leaves? Or would you rather blow like a, a, a like a hundred regular sized leaves or like a hundred billion uh, grain size leaves? I've uh, been busy taking care of my sister's dog. He's a handful. Oh, what what breed is he? Oh, okay. Uh, he's a bo oh, okay. Wow. A little bit of boxer. Interesting. He used to have a Chihuahua Jack Russell. This is adorable. Not cute. Yeah, they're adorable. Oh yeah, they can just run around when they ever they want to. It's hilarious. Okay, 
Let's go there. else is going down with the uh with the playstation let's see let me just check in on twitter a little bit and try to avoid all this the scuzz uh... wait what okay what's this guy doing Okay, just wait. Oof, oof, okay. Uh, the Musk uh, DeSantis uh, thing is going down in in flames. They're, uh... Oh, God. The the website doesn't work. They're, they're going in and out. Uh, Twitter spaces keeps cutting out, cutting off, others are, they're crashing, oh god. Okay, yeah, knew that was gonna be a shit show. It's about as, uh, enjoyable as that, that shithead's facial expressions. The only thing not predictable about, about, predictable about DeSantis is his facial expressions. Oh, and SpaceX just blew up, too, after launching. Okay. Wait, no, is that... No, that's just an old... That's just a metaphor that someone's doing up. Okay, screw this. I got to, uh... Look for... Yeah, everyone's just ragging on them now. Good, good. Okay. Uh... Oh, cheap... Okay, it's not... It's cheap-ass gamer. Which, uh, is the one I follow. That's, um, and it's like a green scent, uh, figure. Hey, a uh, Garfield cart is, uh, 43 cents now. On Steam, of course. I have that game, and I've gotten that game a million times. Because they just get, they, they pack it away and all sorts of stuff. Let's see now. Nothing... Okay. Spider-Man... Ooh! Spider-Man 2! Okay. Symbiote powers. Okay. And a glider suit for Miles Morales. Okay. That's pretty awesome. Okay. Okay. That's pretty good. I wonder if that idiot Musk bought, like, all the traffic from the PlayStation 2. Like, them announcing that would, like, filter into his stupid bullshit. That he could, like, pull the traffic away from that. Anyway, this looks great. He's got symbiote powers. Oh, he's, like, he's got, like, five people up at once with his weird tendrils. Okay, that's gonna be pretty cool. And then some sort of weird green girl. Okay, Uncle Silver, who I follow, just has a picture of... Is that She-Hulk, or is that someone else? Borderlands 2. Or not Borderlands 2. I just... Every time I see that game, I'm, anything that takes place in that universe, I'm like, there's Borderlands 2. Oh, it's Borderlands 2. 3. Um, no, Clone High, Season 2. When did that drop? That's got nothing to do with Sony, that's just my, my, uh, that's just my feed. Uh, 
Oh shit, Tina Turner died. Oh, that sucks. My parents were so big into her. I mean, I listened to her music, of course. We all did. Shit. Well, let's see. Oh, there's Craven the Hunter. Did it drop yesterday? Okay, I may have to check that out. Let's see. Do, do, do. Nothing else. I'm not seeing anything. Come on. Where's all my... I'm just seeing artwork. People laughing at Musk. Oh, uh, Super Spo. S-P-O-E. Uh... Oh... Yeah, that uh, Zelda Tears of the Kingdom stuff. That, uh, the one girl with the eyeballs. Uh, well, you know what I mean. Um, people have been drawing her a lot. Return to Monkey Island's only 20 bucks. Okay. Pretty good. Okay, I'm gonna get back to my, my stuff. I just needed to... Oh, and there's a lovely picture of a little chicken. My mom's thinking about getting pet chickens. We used to have fancy chickens. Oh yeah, I heard about that. On Mac, on Max, they just like uh, they've condensed even the directors, like the directors, actors. They just said created by. Which is bullshit. What are all these clowns doing? Uh, oh yeah, David. That idiot. Yeah, I cut back on that too. I stay on Netflix. Uh, just because... Um, mainly because mom and grandma like to watch it. And I'm glad they pulled, didn't pull that crap with where they had to like... Oh, well you gotta sign in from your own home, home thing. Um, because... I, I mainly buy it for her and my mom, who's across town. I don't. I haven't watched Netflix, and I don't know how long. This is great. I'm getting a drawing done. I'm getting a stream done. Chili's made. 
It's in the pot, so we don't have to make dinner later tonight. You've been watching stuff off of Tubi, which is free. Yeah, I heard about that. Uh, Pluto was also good. Even though they they also share their their time with a bunch of other weird stuff. Can I watch the new episodes of Bluey? Australian stuff, not the not that Disney censored crap. And he used that word that you called the dishwasher when it wouldn't start working. Oh my. Uh oh, we're was I able to take care of the car stuff? Yeah, yeah. I handled all that. That was all taken care of. Everything's pretty smooth for now. There's nothing that's... Uh, let's see. Yeah, I got that. Got the insurance paid for. It's it's biannually. That's the deal we make. Um, yeah. Everything's pretty good. We're going into June. Which is going to get hotter now, but that's okay. Gonna see if I can keep working outside. Not outside, just in the garage. Which it'll get hotter. I put a uh, little thermometer out there just to see how hot it would get. And it stays about like it's somewhere between the. Uh, at the peak of the day when it's like 101 outside, it'll be like 90 in there. But with the fans, it's pretty good. But this is okay, too. I think this might work out. I've got blankets on the door so that it just blocks out the sound, hopefully.
Grandma is going to be 92 this year. She's just still doing pretty good. She got it. We were, we both did the the backyard today. She had the little blower in her hand. She says, I want to, she calls it playing with it. And so she blew out all the leaves and a few things. And then she got a little tired. She waters. She picks up after stuff. She still cooks sometimes. When she feels like it. Because she gets bored. But it's an okay living arrangement, especially since before my grandpa died, uh, we would go to that home, or not a home, it was like a halfway house between recovery, and he uh, unfortunately got CPAP there, which is uh, something that can happen after you get surgery, especially to a lot of older people. And they were just, they were just older people who were just like, you know, they lost is basically all I could say about them. They were like maybe senile. They People just left them there. And then after she had her heart attack, I was like, nah, that's not going to happen. I was already coming over here and visiting her for like, uh, for like weeks at a time. I would come out here and just do whatever. And then try to work from my apartment, and then I eventually just moved in. I'm sorry, Rocket. Yeah. It's, it's sometimes a pain, because you want to, you know, you want to film stuff or make a lot of noise, and she's, she's this is her house, basically. And I don't want to put any opposition on it, but we work out okay. What is this? Oh, I found a way to edit my audio. That's how I'm able to do a lot of stuff for uh, Side Eye Review. I found a way to edit audio pretty effectively on my phone. So when I take my walks in the morning, I just edit a bunch of it. It's a wave pad for the phone. It's not perfect. Especially since uh, you have to go through and you have to flush out the cache every time you use it. Because it eats up, like, it'll remember everything you ever did on, uh, on your phone. But as long as you, like, use it, save your file, and then flush the cache, uh, it'll, it, it works perfectly. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. Yeah, that sea depth got to, uh, got to my grandpa's brain, too. It for her and then for her. You got to. No, you can't. You can't live like that. You can't. Uh, not you. You can't control things. Uh, there was a while after. There was a while after. 
grandma did have her her heart issue that I and after I moved in they were at points where I was getting a little over obsessed with taking care of her and she didn't like that either because she likes to do things on her own but the one thing that she doesn't do now is drive which that's fine she said her mother gave up the keys at just about the same age And her mother got into a wreck. Not a wreck, but a, a fender bender. And then she was like, well, I didn't, I couldn't, I didn't have enough uh, reflexes and muscle to actually stop it from happening. So you got to drive me around. You gonna drive me, George? George was my grandpa's name. I hate to get heavy like that. It's just that all of a sudden, that's just how I felt. And there was nothing else in front of me to... to fill the void. Oh, need to go back to video games. Uh, let's see. Who... Oh! Uh, okay, it's... Yeah, that... That happens, Rocket, and I'm very sorry for your loss. And I don't want to, like, one-up you, but uh, both both Grandpa and Dad died in, like, a week from each other. My dad had a heart attack, and Grandpa had that sea depth. Um, so... Yeah, I know, it sucks. It really, really, really sucks. Uh, and you feel like just I don't know it's just like the bottom falls out but I'm sure that they every one of them would want you to stop and that's what you got to kind of remember. It's just like, well, they're they're where they are, and you're where you are. So just take what you take the best things you learn from them, and try to keep moving. Yeah, hey, Purple Dragon. Sorry about that. Y yeah, you'll you you may feel like that for a while. I, that's that's how I felt because it's just all of a sudden, and then you just got to keep on moving in order to to, to to you know get things done. My uh. You know, just to help your help mom and help grandma, and I think that's the way I felt. I felt like I like lost maybe. I didn't lose it, but it just like it just went by in like a flash. Like maybe the last ten years. Definitely those f for five years.
gitu dong Oh, that's right, Izzy. Yeah, yeah. You've uh, done. You've changed your uh, your account name and your little uh, your little icon. Yeah, that's that's that can be hard too. I I've, I've had a relative who fits that exact mold. Uh rocket. Yeah. It can be hard. Okay, anyway, let's... Ugh. Yeah. Yeah, I've got some relatives that are, are like that, too. Anyway, let's... Good. So, anything else happened with the uh, PlayStation... Uh... What, what presentation or whatever now I just got a hankering to uh, watch all those E3 conferences that uh, the super best friends used to do uh, it was my, my favorite one is still when they uh, they popped off when um, what was it oh it was she freak that's just a um, a free movie YouTube wants to show me. Um, what was I gonna say? Oh, when they popped off when uh, 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 Devil May Cry 5 popped on. What is she, freak? Now I gotta look at this. Carnival of Souls? Wait, they want you to pay for Carnival of Souls? Puss in Boots is free. Currently. Danny Versus is free. That's awesome. Ace Ventura is free. They want you to rent the anime, anim, the the latest Amityville movie. Okay, the Puss in Boots, the last. Yeah, they want you to uh, buy your rent, buy your rent, John Wick Four. That's fine. That's that's perfectly reasonable. Uh, Master and Commander is free with ads. Galaxy Quest is free with ads, of course. Oh, they did Ridge Racer? They want me to buy Ted 2. Get out of town. Yeah, Dan Versus is totally free with ads if you want to just watch them all. Dance Flick. Oh no, that's a Wayne's Brothers movie. I didn't even know they made this. Oh, and the font is so horrible. I gotta see this. What the Wayne Brothers did for Scary Movie, they're now doing for Dance Flick. Get ready for non-stop hilarity. I doubt. Uh, with the... Sweet Innocent Megan's Ballet Dream. So it's like the most boilerplate. Oh, this came out in 2009? I thought this was like recent. Like, when did they even make this?
Oh, okay. So anyway, this is American Genre Film Archive. And this is like from the 1960s. Okay, it's about a waitress who leaves the greasy diner business for the excitement of the carnival. Okay. She quickly discovers she despises freaks and human oddities. So it's just... It's just freaks. A remake. But this took place in 1966. Oh, there's a little cowboy. And he's like tracking someone. That's cute. Oh, I want to do an MST3K on this. What is this? Okay, yeah, this should totally be- this would have totally been on MST3K. Except this print looks really, really good. Oh yeah, Freaked is hilarious. I remember seeing that on, uh, on, uh, Sci-Fi Channel. That's like what's his face best um best movie before he went crazy. Styrofoam cup. And then you just got the the crowd just going rowdy and just being crazy and it's like Quiet, please. Oh, and Procreate has uh, has no plans to introduce AI imaging or generation to their tool set. Good for them. Yeah, everyone's laughing at Musk and uh, DeSantis because their thing went shit show. But anyway, in local news, Carrie Lake is having her own shit show. Uh, a judge ruled against her. Um, she's, she's just having a nothing events, nothing burger events where she's like teasing her new, her new thing. It's... Okay. Pictures, 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 pictures. Nothing. Marathon. What is this? Marathon. Who? Uh... Marathon is coming to the PS5 and PC. What? Ooh! Oh, those are bugs. Those are bugs making a robot. They're eating something and then pooping something. From Bungie. Oh boy. So this is the this is not going to be on PS4. They've decided. Green goo. Marathon. Is that based on the marathon game? Like uh the one that uh 
Man Mandorian Gaming has done. That looks like Sho Shoji or Shojin or whatever her, her name is on Bioshock. I mean System Shock. Ooh, Sniper. And the guy turns into... Goo. And the moon is pierced by some sort of crystal. Interesting. Yeah, that looks like they're actually doing it. Like they're bringing back the old mar marathon franchise. It's some sort of shooter, but there's no actual gameplay. Oh, I use, um, uh, uh, Paint Tool Seiya has, uh, uh, some, like, limited, they're still good, but, um, limited vector lines. Um, like, I wish there was a way to, like, store shape. Uh, you've got circles, triangle, and square. So far, there's doesn't seem to be any way to, like, make new vector shapes. Unless, shoot. Uh, make new vector shapes in, not Photoshop, not After Effects, not CC+, Paint Tool Saya, or Saya, or whatever the hell it is. How to make vector lines, pen tools... How to draw in vector? No. No, there doesn't seem to be any documentation about it. Crap. Um... There's, um... I wish that the guy who, who made Paint Tool got paid more. Um... So that way he could... Oh, yeah, that's the art. That's the art I was talking about. That's the artist. Um... And I was like, that's the, actually, that's the main image I used for the inspiration of the body type. Yeah, yeah, you know that guy. Uh, what is he? Let's see, what, has he posted any new stuff? That, uh... That redhead girl is d doing things for me. Let's see, um, Monster Grotto was their name? Monster Grotto. Slash mouth hugs? Okay, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, they're into, uh... They're into that Vor stuff. No, they haven't been posting lately. This is some of their old stuff I remember from a while back. Well, I mean, they've been posting, but it's mainly, like, what, how they feel about Zelda Tears of the Kingdom.
do do do. Dragons. Dragon. Ah, cute little blue dragon girl. Yeah, who do you think's m more mad? Like, do you think... Nah, I was just... I, there seems to be equal... Ooh, Digital Revolver! Okay, what did they do? Uh, It's co... Something... I It won't load, but it's co-directed by James Turner, who, helped, who worked on Amphibia. Let's see, what is it? Come on, load. Oh, the Plucky Squire. Okay, it's a story-based thing. Jot. Oh, cute. Oh, it looks like it may be kind of like a RPG Earthbound thing. Oh, and they jumped off the storybook. Okay, that's cool. And now they got to go around the 3D platform. Oh, I'm getting like really good uh, Zelda um, Between Two Worlds vibes off of this. This is awesome. Okay, there's some timing based platforming, timing based situations. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, that looks great. Uh, do, 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 do. Uh, um, what else is there? Oh, the secret of the Mogwai just dropped. And it looks like it's getting pretty good reviews. Okay, color me surprised. <laughs> Who's a good friend of yours? Um, Monster Grotto? Or the guy who helped make an amphibia? Yeah, yeah, the gremlin thing, which is pretty cool. I, I, I kind of dig the, uh, the idea of an origin story. Taking place in China, I think? Maybe, I hopefully. Don't want to be racist. The, uh, the, the gentleman was Chinese, right? In the original movie. Oh, that would suck if that's the the if the no I don't think that would, that's there's too much time in between I was like what if the what if the old man in the movie was like the kid from the TV series and I was like no that that's too that's too much 
That takes place way before then. Like, mogwais are an actual thing. Like, in, uh, in Chinese mythology, I think. And then gremlins are the things that we came... Are, like, I think they were originally made in Britain. I think the British Air Force did that as a... You know... The, it's, it's, you know, uh, what, what do you call it? Um... You know, propaganda for making sure that, you know, all your your airplane parts are working right. Like, don't let a gremlin get in the airplane or something like that. I gotta watch Gremlins 2 again. It was like one of my favorite movies growing up. Uh, for Mother's Day, I bought... Oh, I've told this story before. But for Mother's Day, I bought a... Uh, one of those game consoles. That, uh, you know, has all the Nintendo games on it. Because I have the, my original Nintendo, but... My mom does... She wants to play Super Mario Brothers, And she doesn't quite know how to, like, all the ins and outs... Of making sure that it works right. You know, blowing in the cartridge, that sort of things. So I bought her a uh, one a, one of those things that plays all the games. A little emulator. Nintendo would make a killing if they just like sold the controllers alone, with like a, a you know like a series of pre-made ga pre-programmed games. Like, uh, what, what? They used to do that all the time. You used to get all the Pac-Man games put together. Ah, jeez, uh, Gent, thanks. That's awesome. Yeah, they are good, and they've got like the original Mario, and that's what she just—that's what she just wanted. I put a list of where all the games. It starts on like Double Dragon and Ninja Turtles and stuff like that. And also, I've started looking through them, and they got a bunch of weird stuff on there, like Devil World. I don't even know how to play that. It was weird. It was like this—you're on this stage. Like, the whole stage just rotates around. It's like a combination of Pac-Man and, uh... Yeah, like Pac-Man and, 
and Kirby kinda and this devil like tells tells the, his minions where where the stage to go. It's really cool. I may actually sneak it away from her. Oh, actually, I don't need to do that. I just need to write down what games I want to play and just get a better emulator. You see, I was telling mom about, like, emulators and was just like, well, just download the game. Just play it off of... What do I use? RetroArch. Uh, they do that. It was called the Nintendo Mini. It didn't have every game, just 30 or so. Handpicked. Well, mine is... Kind of, it, it, it may have fell, fallen off of a truck, but it, uh, it works, it works. It's got all the games. Remember what Stephanie Sterling says, it's always morally correct to pirate Nintendo games. I haven't seen the new Clone High episodes. I really want to, though. I've got to actually figure out where I can watch it. Is it HBO? I mean, uh, Max or whatever? They call themselves this week. Hey, Purple Goop. Okay, Max, I gotta check that out. Maybe I've earned another uh, couple of, you know, like another free trial. I signed up for Max like maybe about two years ago. You know what else is a really good show that I just started getting into? Uh, uh, what was it called? Something North? Wild North? Up North? The Great North. Okay, that's it. Uh, I don't need this. I want the good stuff. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Okay, good. Okay. 
Yeah, that's about right. Just wait. So, what are we talking about? Um, it's on Max. Theory is that they changed the app name and app itself to knock people out of the AT&T free HBO Max deal. Oh my gosh! Really? Uh, a game I'm on. Wait. Oh my god. A game I'm on is almost ready for a trailer. It has m multiple of my anime. Oh, cool! Right on. Okay, so you're under NDA, so you can't. Okay, well, that's cool. Wait, it, it does nothing to do with your former employers, does it? Neon Junk City. Ooh, cool. Cool, cool, cool. That sounds great. Uh, nope, I have no ties with them at all. Okay. You own a bunch... You legally own a bunch of the Yo Mama characters because of the Cali Law. Anything I made with a contract means I still own it. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, we'll use it. Oh, what was it? Um, It was a recent... Uh, it's a recent lead, uh, Red Letter Media thing where they were talking about how the guy... Who made Troll? Uh, what was it? Uh, who made Troll? Just the movie Troll, you know? You know how there's a character called Harry Potter in there? Well, he was... he uh, Legally, he could make another movie with that character. Since it's a loophole. Since he he made a movie with Harry Potter in it and first. So... But then he died. And couldn't do anything with it. With that idea. should buy the rights from troll if you bought the rights from troll the movie the movie franchise and you can make another movie harry potter and the horrible transphobic crone And it's just like a, 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 a JR stand-in. And she gets torn apart by 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 trolls for like the runtime. The guy behind the channel never did contact us, so Red Minus more or less owns all of the Wait, Red Minus? Wait, are we talking about that one...
Is that that one animation? Did they do that like that that one? Uh, let me let me look this up. This is not right. This can't be the the one I'm thinking of. Uh, Marvel versus Cap. Um, more. Morgan cartoon. No, that's not right. Something like that. Wait, is it who I'm thinking of? Like, they did all those weird... This is Johnny Utah, one of his cartoons. I want the other one, the one that made made. No way. Why don't I just search red minus? Why am I doing such it's why am I doing such gymnastics? Yeah, like red minus the 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 internet guy? Burger time. Uh, what did they do? Just wait, just wait. Red minus. What was their one? A red minus Capcom. I'll just do that. Yes, yes. Yeah, Nene Cat... Capcom. Yeah, yeah. Don oh no, it's Dante. That's why I wasn't coming up. Because it's Dante. So wait, yeah, I guess I could see it now. I mean, it's... Not to put a harp on anything, that's why they hired you, but it's Flash animation. The timing is, like... They they could do a lot of a lot of people have access to this to the timing tools. But yeah, I'm seeing it now. So wait, he owns what they? I thought it was a girl. Don't they do the voice acting for like the, the Nene video and the in the park? Like Shadow Blade, Shadow Blade. Well, then who's the voice at? Okay, well, never mind. Oh, okay, never mind. Okay, so that's, yeah, that's Nene Cax and then something. Okay. Okay, groovy. So wait, do they own your mama? Oh, okay. Well, we've officially lapsed. Uh, hold on. There we go. I thought it would stop. Anyway, there you go. It's, uh, that's a big Tonya. Anyway, what is it now? Oh, it's almost 4.30. I gotta get... I gotta get some stuff around. Anyway, this was fun. Um, and I got a lot of stuff done on this side of the screen. So, yeah, that was great. 
and it was cooler, much more cooler than it is out in the garage, and I already have all my stuff set up here. Um, yeah, if I can keep the volume down, then maybe I can just work from here now. Um, yeah, she's cute. I should draw more fat characters. I should draw Hoppo. Hoppo and Isis and a Vanderchill. You can't say Isis now without adding the Vanderchill. Um, all the Disney I was just looking at, I was just thinking about that. It's mostly Disney characters. Hmm. Anyway, um, yeah. Okay, uh, I never know how to sign off. But anyway, thank you all for joining me. Shoot, and thank you, gent, for all the, the cash you throw my way. We will get another, uh, another one of yours done soon. Um, yeah, in the meantime, just uh, hang out. I think we're uh, Melanie will have another stream tonight. And, I don't know. I fi rush. Oh, I've I've installed Overwatch both on my PS2, uh, the PS4, and my computer, because no, no, who's who's your character, a uh, pumpkin? Hit me up on a DM. You know where I'm at. Uh, but anyway, um, yeah, we'll we'll figure out what we do next time. Anyway, and I've got more of these. I've got a back catalog. Of, of art drawings and more making making more every day anyway so yeah i'll see you guys all later thank you for joining me and uh just you know hang tight until next time see y'all bye bye mm -hmm.